guys. Yo, Mac, let's see what up. What are you guys doing here so early? Aren't you guys supposed to be in school or something? <laughs> We graduated, Mac. Seniors get out two weeks before everyone else. <laughs> really? You guys graduated? And you're not smart enough to find anything to do than to hang out around here all day? Parents kicked us out again. What do you suggest, Holmes? Well, if you guys are going to hang out around here all summer, you might as well work here. That way you can get an apartment or something and not just sit around all day and wait for the evening scraps. Uh, sorry, dog. We're going to work at Priscilla's. The sex shop? You think you can get me in there, too? I don't know, Mac. We done put in 27 applications so far and ain't got no response. Good morning, Rick. Good morning. What are you doing before work this morning? Nothing. Nothing? Is that? Yep. Maybe it is. All right. Hey, right, guys. I got to go open the store. If any customers come out before 11, tell them to piss off. simple for you. The lady out there, the one you just tried to throw out. My, my bad. She's from corporate, you idiot. She can get us all fired. Just like that. Oh, I'm sorry. My bad. Look, dude, these tests show evidence of seven different illegal narcotics. I don't need evidence of one to can your ass right here and now. Come on, Mac. You don't want to do that. You love me. I'll do whatever you want, just don't fire me, right? Sucking your fucking dick, I don't do that shit. Come on, man, please don't fire me. I'll do anything. All right, dude, here's the deal. So, uh, everything going well? For me, yes. You, well, let's just say you're starting with a few correct. Ow! For instance, these cans don't even have their labels. Well, actually, we, we just open them, you know, when we get them in to see what they are. You know, we taste test them, so it's like one big fun puzzle box. Oh, God. Aw, you're all wet. Inspector Reed, I'm so sorry. Is there anything I can do to help? A wet towel would be a great start. You got it. I'll be right back.
me, but are you aware that over half these products are like two years past their expiration dates? Uh, hey boss, this shit's greener than my weed. <laughs> oh, actually ma'am, that's my fault, you know. My boss instructed me to check the expiration date, so uh, let me just get this shit out of the way and I'll take it home with me and feed it to my cat or something like that. You can't be forgetting things like this. I hope this problem will be rectified immediately. Oh, it it'll be rectified. Trust me, it'll be rectified. I cannot believe he has such a disregard for his job. It seems this young man is responsible for a lot of the problems in the store. Well, you know, the shortcomings of one can cause a whole operation to crumble. And crumble it has, Mr. McDonald. The store in this condition should be closed permanently. I assure you that our employees will have the restaurant operating within corporate guidelines. We just need a little bit of time. I will grant you one week's time to get this place in working order. That should give you enough time to prepare for the founder's arrival. The founder is coming here? That is correct, and he is quite displeased with your apparent lack of progress. We shall double our efforts. I hope so, for your sake. The founder is not as forgiving as I am. As I'm sure you all have heard, we failed our performance review. I mean, we did so bad that the founder, Guido Luigi Papa Giorgio, <laughs> is going to pay us a visit in a week to try and scare us back into working. Guido Luigi. <laughs> yeah, we could call him Gooey Louie. Hey, this is not something to be taken lightly. Yeah. <clears throat> I want to talk to you guys about how to make this place maybe a little cleaner, run a little better before this guy arrives. Uh, I can make him a pizza he can't refuse. <laughs> <laughs> Knock it off, Willie. I I'm 30 years old and I can't land a gig better than this. That's, uh, it's pretty sad, sir. No shit, Sherlock, but I hate working here just as much as you do. Yeah, but what have we got to lose? Another crap-ass job? Man, speak for yourself, dog. I like dealing the pieces, yo. I like working here, too. Everybody wants beach fucking green card. Well, if we want to keep our jobs, we're going to actually have to work. Exactly what do you classify as work? Well, according to the corporate guidelines, we have to clean the store every night, treat our customers with respect, and uh, we have to serve our food in accordance with the FDA requirements. I don't know, man. That sounds pretty hard. And gay. Sounds like from now on gone. It's three in the afternoon. My best time. Hey, Elmer. Little tip for next time. Brush the french fry crumbs off your tits before you lie to someone. Come on. Don't worry. He didn't miss much. Yeah, we were all just informed that we're getting fired. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had a store inspection and failed miserably. Okay, mm -hmm. everyone, let's put it to a vote. All for cleaning up the store and remaining happy employees of Papa Giorgio's Pizza, raise your hand. Yeah! Okay, all for letting the store slip into the seventh layer of hell where it fucking belongs. Survey says, fuck it. Yeah. Well, one week till Tuesday. Live it up, boys.